The Snapdragon 870 is really the Snapdragon 865 plus plus. And the question is, how does it compare to the original Snapdragon 865? Today we're going to be testing the Poco F3 with the Snapdragon 870 against the OnePlus 8 with the Snapdragon 865. Which one do you think is going to win? Well, let's find out. So the Poco F3 with the Snapdragon 870 on the left hand side, we have the original OnePlus 8 with the Snapdragon 865 on the right hand side. So really these are kind of the same generation, although the 870 has come out very recently. Uh, but of course the 870 is kind of clocked a bit higher, tweaked a bit. So let's see what the difference is in performance. All things being equal, we expect the 870 in the Poco F3 to win. And as I'm saying that we are into the compression test, my guess is at this point that yes, the Poco F3 is in the lead. It was the first into the 16th thread test. Now the OnePlus 8 is into the 16th thread test. Both of these, of course, got the same basic CPU design, octa-core, so they should have no problem with that. And they haven't had, as we go into the blur test, which is the beginning of the mixed CPU GPU part of speed test G coming up in a moment, coming in the smoke particle test, which one will be able to offer the best 2D frame rates. We're now going through that infinite scrolling list. Let's see what happens on the left-hand side. We've got the smoke particle test already underway by the Poco F3. What's around 29 frames a second, pretty solid there. On the right-hand side now, what we can see, 28, 29. So, very very, very similar there, very, very similar. But the Poco F3 was the first in to the Unity test. It's the first one doing this flyover. It will be the first one, I think, that will get to the end of the valley and then off into the Unreal test. Yes, there it is. It's now into the Unreal test as the OnePlus 8 is now also just about to start the Unreal test. Let's see what happens. It gets to the end of the path here. What's it going to be? There we go. 1 minute 22.2. It can't be too far behind the OnePlus 8. What's it going to be? 1 minute 27.5. Okay, let's break down the scores and see what happened. So as we saw, there a win for the Poco F3, 1 minute 22.2, and then the OnePlus 8 came in 5.3 seconds later, 1 minute 27.5. So what happened? CPU 36.6 versus 38.9. That's a difference of 2.3 seconds. That's quite significant there. So the uh, Snapdragon 870 proving its worth there in the CPU department. When we get to the mix CPU GPU, again, a win for the Poco F3 and the Snapdragon 870, 21.1 versus 22.5 as a difference of 1.4 seconds. And then when we get to the GPU again, another win by the Poco F3, 24.4 versus 26 as a, a win of 1.6 seconds. So the 870 is clearly the superior processor when compared to the 865, as you would expect. And because of all that, the Poco F3 won with 1 minute 22.2. My name is Gary Sims, this is Speed Test G. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. Probably not best to rely on the recommendation algorithm. You may not have seen this video, but if you subscribe and hit that bell notification icon, you will know every time I drop a new Speed Test G video. Okay, that's it. I'll see you in the next one.